we just got word earlier today at, that Among Us, yes, Among Us, is getting a TV show adaptation with the creator of Infinity Train, Owen Dennis, at the helm to bring this to life at CBS Studios alongside Titmouse Studios, which is basically the people who animated Big Mouth. Thoughts on this one? Thoughts on a Among Us show? All right, so at first, I was already excited because I think you could do some really cool things with Among Us. Like, it's, I hate using the word cringe, but, like, that's, like, what you associate Among Us with now because it's so fucking annoying. But, like, in concept, like, you could make a really sick show. Uh, the fact that the dude from Infinity Train is attached to this, oh, this could be super sick. Um, the fact, but the, then then you throw in the people who, who you said animated Loudmouth? Uh, it was Big Mouth, and I believe it was another show. I can't Big remember. Mouth. Big mouth, and that's the that was the weird show about like the sexy like the kids who are like going through puberty. I believe so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, I don't like their animation. Uh, those kids looked weird. Um, so that's the only <laughs> thing I'm afraid of with the Among Us show. I don't even know what an Among Us show would look like animated. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even. Are they gonna keep the the same like simple art style? Are they gonna go like super super above and beyond? But I think an Among Us show would be. I'm more interested in Among Us show than any show we've talked about on this podcast today. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it a bean. Just because of it's the dude who made Infinity Train, and again he did shit with regular shows. Well, I can yeah. see, it, I can see, I can see it being that like hodgepodge animation style of you know of execution, and I think Among Us could pull it off. You know what I'm saying? Again, just how it innately is in the game. Like when you kill somebody, it kind of changes its art style a little bit to you know execute kills or whatever, and you know at least create a little bit of a difference there. I think that this show could actually be really, really good. You know what I mean? Like, I, and it's the, the plot simple. You do an actual like it's like eight episode or twelve episode run. There's one killer in the place, and the crew is actual characters that stick to him. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody has a voice. Everybody has a you know not a face, but you know everybody has a color or whatever. And you just go down that route and just expand on it. Like it's easy. The plot's right there. It would be also interesting if each episode. So like I'm not obviously I'm not working on this show, but a really cool concept. A really cool concept that I have for it would be like. Um, every episode, people die, but then they come back to life, like in the next episode. Kind of like how Kenny dies in South Park. Mm, um, be hard. Not not everybody dies the same, but so basically, every episode would be like a random game of Among Us, but they mm. kind of have like a sitcom kind of story to like tie all the episodes together. So like random episodes, like Blue will die, but Blue will be back by the next episode because it's all like yeah. every episode is a different game kind of thing. That's hard, but like, bro. They have I, these stories between the shit. Really you know what I'm saying? Like that's yeah, pretty. That's, that's pretty ca- sick. That's, that's kind of hard. Yeah, I thought like, I thought like this this show could be amazing. Like, it could be pretty cool. You can do a lot with it. You can get so <laughs> creative with this as well. Like, I feel like they're gonna because of the fan base that Among Us has. I feel like we're not gonna really get to see the show that we would want to see. Yeah, but if yeah. we were gonna get the show that we would we would like to see, I feel like it could go crazy. Because like, what I'm thinking of now is like all the different colors have like their own personalities and like yeah. so they would re- that the game would reset after after every episode right and it would just be like short stories through you know an episode or, or like a, a a full like among us session basically yeah um i think in terms of the animation style if they go for like that fucking big mouth shit then yeah that flop anyway but if they if they just kind of stick to what they have already um and then i guess like the mixed animation you know like if something let's say like the the red character he his character is very angry because he has the color red right mm-hmm. from the time he goes from like being calm to being accused and he gets mad like the animation starts switches and there's loads of detail in his face like that kind mm-hmm. of that kind of like animation is what i had in mind when i first like was thinking about this yeah this this show has the potential to pop the fuck off like is it's mm-hmm. a really really cool concept to play the social deception like yeah theme anyway is 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 perfect and i love to watch any kind of me i like to consume any kind of media with that with that theme yeah it's so, like knives out like yeah like knives out um i don't know if you guys have seen this film but the murder on the orient express yes of course yeah a, amazing film mm-hmm. amazing book too um yeah there's stuff like that i love to watch so any kind of social deception thing is always gonna like be good mm. I, I agree i think it's there's a lot of wiggle room with especially how uh, I guess it's the the spirit of uh, what's it called Among Us has manifested over the years since it dropped in the pandemic. Just like it's it's a lot of 
there, there, there is, there's creepy, there's funny, there's serious, there's spooky. There's a lot of emotions and feelings and things that people have invested and created within that space in terms of what, you know, like whatever memes and stories and all that stuff. Like they, there's a lot of stuff that flows from it. So I feel like there's, there's going to be more than enough for, uh, for, you know, for that team to explore and actually make out of. And again, as soon as they said infinity train, I'm like, oh, okay, they're going to make something good out of this. So th- th- that, that, that track, or, that track record alone you know what I'm saying? Gives me a lot more confidence in what this series can be. 